Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Kerry Arthur, and this is Dead Rising, which is now out on PC, remastered, and available to purchase right now. And it's like $15.99, which isn't bad, off Steam. It, that's, that's pretty good. I know it's an older game, it's 2006 it was first released, but still, still that's not bad. Uh, let's turn it up a bit, let's turn it up a bit, come on, let's do it. So, we've got a decent number of graphics options here, you've got screen resolution, refresh rate is 60, which is nice. Proper 60 FPS, I'll take it. Yes, I, I would like to accept changes. Thank you very much. So what we're going to do is we are just going to go through the first half an hour to an hour, see what it's like, and hopefully it'll turn out to be pretty damn good. I've never played the original um, the original Dead Rising. I played Dead Rising 3, and I thought that was pretty good, except the, the kind of comedy of ripping people apart with chainsaws, chainsaws on sticks didn't work when the character's a whiny bitch. Which he was. He was like, oh god, zombies? Oh, this is the worst thing ever. Whilst simultaneously murdering them by the thousands. Didn't really work. I've heard nothing but good things about the original Dead Rising, though. Obviously, it's going to look a little bit ropey because it's from 2006. I mean, come on. What? It's, it's not like... It's not a massive kind of everything has been replaced you know, with modern textures, modern everything. It's, it's a remaster, but it's, it's been brought up to date as opposed to remade. Which is fine. You mentioned something about research for a story. I did indeed. Right. Got a tip that something big's happening. I believe he turns out to be right about that and all. They sure didn't mention anything about it on TV. Well, then it, yeah, well, I'm freelance, pal. it wouldn't be a, a tip off that something's happening <laughs> if he was watching it on TV, would it? It would just be a new story, but helicopter pilots, they just don't know what they're talking about. Just stick to flying the aircraft, man. Don't don't, don't speak. Here she is. <laughs> Willamette, Colorado. Population 53,594. Distinguishing characteristics. Jack shit. <laughs> Harsh. <laughs> About the only thing to do in this town is kill time at the shopping mall. A <laughs> nice little reference to what you'll actually be doing now. I like that. <laughs> This is already. This is already like this is puzzling compared to Dead Rising Three. Like there's, there's actual humour here. Like there's there's a direct sort of reference to what you're going to be doing. It's like a cheeky little nod. Cough. That was uh. That was not a slow loading screen. Cool. Zombies for days. I quite like this little segment actually. Oh, that was rubbish. That was rubbish, that one. Oh, presumably this would be worth some... The hell? Oh, nice! No, got the baseball bat. Yeah, beat the shit out of that guy. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Is it going to show him getting eaten? Because that would be cool. That would be cool. Do it so I can take a photo of it. Great. <laughs> Is this what you came to take of? Uh, I guess probably not. Not specifically that. Oh, oh, we're going to get it. We're going to get it. Come on. Oh, what? Okay, hang on. All those... Oh. oh, no way. Right on a school bus. There's no need for that, is there? No genre. I, I feel like I've missed something with that, but this is still funky. Oh, can we... Uh... <laughs> what the hell is going on? <laughs> Presumably there's going to be more disasters. Way more. 
I'm guessing there are kids in there, I assume. I mean, I, I you know, sucks to be them. Should have hired a helicopter. Surely that would be the safest way to get your kids to school in a, an apocalyptic scenario. Dump them all on a chop. Well, mind you, you don't know it's going to be an apocalyptic scenario until it is. So I suppose that's kind of a moot point, really, isn't it? Oh, well. Brutality. <laughs> it's just like, what? <laughs> oh, funky little fire effects there. I like that. Oh, oh, oh. Christ. In case the smoke... I mean, yeah, the smoke's blocking the view, so definitely do that. Good grief. The hell? What are they doing? Not bad. Come on, that wasn't... That was all right. Oh, shit, she's got a gun. Oh, I need to get shooting someone. Come on. Good grief. It's like, it's a bit harsh, this. I feel bad. I actually genuinely feel bad for taking photos, but it's the only thing that you can do. No, don't do it, love. Don't do it. That was a rubbish fire, wasn't it? Oh, nice! Nice throw! That is... That is... What the fuck? Oh, shit! What the hell? Oh, I feel mean. I feel really mean now. I would never make it as a war photographer. I'd be like, nah, this I'm not I'm not feeling it. I want to see the center of town. Take me there. I'd prefer to be uh, one of those guys who takes photos of food. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the, you know, what's funny? you see an ice on the McDonald's menu and it looks amazing and then you actually get it in real life and it looks like a pile of shit. I wanna be the guy that makes that happen. <laughs> Bloody Frank West food photographer. <laughs> what an amazing game that'd be. Convenient. Can you get me on the rooftop of that mall? You gotta be kidding me. No, do it. Man, you are nuts. I don't know what you're complaining about, mate. You've got a fucking chopper. Right, Surely listen. it doesn't even matter. Don't forget to come back for me. As long as you're not dead, Fred. It's Frank. Frank West. Remember that name, because the whole world's gonna know it in three days when I get Bit nice. Nice bit of shirt clipping. That seems like a very risky way to try and stop someone from landing. <laughs> what if we what if just like flown forwards and hit you? This is quite what the hell. He's totally going to get shot down. He's so going to get shot down. What a nutter. I'm fucking loving Frank West already. What a hero. Right, mate. You're the reporter, aren't you? Yeah. You came alone. Nice shirt. Yeah, I'm freelance. Real nice. Zombie apocalypse, the usual. You came by helicopter, didn't you? Yep. What did you see from the sky? <laughs> well, people being eaten, zombies being hit in the head with baseball bats. Just a riot. I doubt the military would quarantine the entire area. The moratorium on information getting out is a little extreme, in my opinion. You would say that, though, wouldn't you? Uh, something else I can't put my finger on. Your chest hair. Doesn't sound like civil disobedience. Or lack thereof. It's too quiet. 
Almost as if everyone's already dead. <laughs> it's so cheesy, I love it. So why don't you just tell me already? What's going on? Yeah, let's hear it. I think you'd better see for yourself. I mean, I want that this guy. I want that guy's shirt and medallion. Is hell. Very, uh, very melodramatic. Very melodramatic. I'm liking it. <laughs> I don't know what it is about his face, but it's not. He's not the stereotypical rugged-looking hero, is he? I'm loving how quick the loading times are. Fantastic. Frank must be on the heliport at 12pm on the 22nd, or he'll be left behind in the mall. Pay careful attention to the time as you play. Alright then. Turn to the game. Right. Okay, Carlito. I mean, I was the only one brave enough to come. Nope. Well, it feels a little... I feel like there's some sort of mouse smoothing going on whilst I'm moving around, actually. Uh, uh, the public restroom. Oh, there's, oh there's, the sofa. Okay. Consider progress saved. I mean, it feels old in a way. I mean, the like the interface definitely looks old, but then it would do because it's two thousand and six, ain't it? What have we got in here then? All right. Oh, nice. <laughs> All right. Christ. Nice shirt. All right. So let's have uh, let's have that for no reason other than uh, the option was there. I'm assuming this is more clothes. Yeah. <laughs> Straight away the game's just like it's a bunch yeah. of it's a bunch of outfits. Enjoy. I mean we've got to go for that, haven't we? Okay. Uh, I'm assuming that's similar through there. Anything uh, anything new? Anything different? No. All right then. Ooh. Oh, here we go. That's not going to end well for her. That's not going to, uh... Nope. In the world. Zombies, mate. Zombies. Right. Is there any... God, there's a lot of stuff already. There's just a lot. There's a, there's. The, it doesn't seem to be in the mood for uh, dropping you in slow. It's just like here's a load of rooms and a load of stuff to explore, which is fine. Fine. Not not got a problem with it. What I've got to do is remember my way around because there's seems to be quite a lot of uh, places you can go around here. Ah, all right. Oh no, that's walk. Is there a sprint? Shift is walk. I think I might be just all just this speed in general. Oh, go to check the watch. Nice. Nice. Now. Ah, there we go. We're in the mall proper. In our new red suit. <laughs> For no reason other than I decided to put a red suit on. Hey, bring that over here. Come on, bring it over. Madonna? What a pimp. God, get out of my face, woman. I'm pretty sure your dog's dead. I hate to break it to you, but, uh... Pretty sure... No more dog for you. Oh, look at that. He's like, oh, yes. Things might be looking rough, but you ain't. 
gonna get yourself eaten alive by zombies? What? Oh did yes. He did, he said zombies. Take a look out there. <laughs> Frank was not the not the quickest man. Uh even if he's a journalist. Oh. That dude had a weird neck. There's been more and more of them since last night. Now they're all that's they gravitate to the living. Unlike you, you're you're at the you're in the the peak of your physical prowess. Take a look around the mall. Bring anything we can use for the barricade back here. On delay. Come on, pronto. He's just like, no, mate. I'm taking photos. I've got shit to do here. I'm only going to be here for like 72 hours, and then I'm leaving. Speaking of which, okay, I ain't talking to her. She's clearly a nutter. Oh, yeah, probably. Okay. Mark, Kathy, Alan. I just started walking. I guess we'll come over here and grab some of this then. Man, a lot of loading is going on. Luckily, it's really quick, but I, I shudder to think how bad the loading was on, like, the 360. This dude's lost it. Absolutely. What the? I mean, is he in the wrong place? Because he's behind that security barrier. Uh oh. Oh, she's got that mad old woman strength. Oh, the dog's gonna fuck her up. Tell me the dog's gonna fuck her up. Uh. That what is he? You, you mad bat. I knew she was trouble. I knew that was gonna go badly. I, I absolutely knew it. Don't look at me. Don't look at me, it was the mad old woman. Everyone, move this way. Quick, to the stairs. Move. You don't have to tell me twice, mate. Oh, oh shit, I'm going the wrong way. Oh, you fucking what? Oh shit, can I not, can I? Oh, that's the fucking camera. Okay, well, I'm just going to go at the stairs, because uh, these guys are already dead. Don't mind me. We'll tease it. Tease it round. Tease it round. Tease it round. Tease it round. Oh, there we go. Nice. I headed to the stairs. Yeah, I, I really I really do shudder to think how bad the loading was when this first came out. Because there's a lot of loading screens, and they, they take like, what, maybe, maybe a second, maybe two max at the moment, but Christ. Where are the others? Dead. I don't know. I hope they got away. They didn't. I can tell you that now. So you know what needs to be done. Weld the door. As long as those things are in the mall, we better not use this door. God damn! I was supposed to get back to the chopper now. Back into the mall, and apparently those things aren't smart enough to use the ducks, so they won't be a factor. This dude has got it planned out. You want to get back in there? 
What for? Supplies, man. Weapons. Crazy costumes. You name it. Hey. Hey. He's going on a rescue mission. <laughs> She's just like nice suit, idiot. Are you a photographer? As a matter of fact, I am. Frank West, photojournalist. Could you show me some pictures, Frank? She's gonna rip out the film and throw it away. I say rip out the film. It's clearly a digital camera. <laughs> you seem to know what you're doing. Who are you guys anyway? And what are you? We're mall security. I took that one near the entrance. <laughs> something. He's my father. No. Thanks for showing me, though. She's yeah. really not happy about this, is she? Uh, hey, we're not done talking yet. Just who are you guys? He wants answers. Frank wants answers. I'm Jesse. The man you saw earlier is Brad. That's all I'm authorized to tell you. Oh, shit. This is some FBI, CIA shit going down. Nice. <laughs> well, that could be a problem. Right, Otis. I am planning on going back out into the mall. Oh, nice, a transceiver and a map. Awesome. Right, it says examine it, so he's not going that way again. Oi. Talk to me. But why? Why? That's, that's, that's my question to you. Why can't you answer me? Hang on, we came down here, didn't we? Yeah, we came down this staircase, so we can still get onto the roof. We've just got to wait a while for the chopper to come back. Which is a pity, really. I bet Frank wishes he was coming back a bit earlier now. But he's a photojournalist. He wanted to, uh... He wanted to know what was going down, and now he knows. <laughs> and he knows that it was really bad. So the rooftop and the heliport are two different things. Okay. Just his hair sticking out. <laughs> now the mystery begins. Where did the other guy go? Hey, anybody around? Oh, hello, Jeff. Jeff, you want to shut the fuck up, mate? Uh, no, I've not seen Natalie. Sorry, I didn't mean to elbow you there. That was not intentional. But we can call the lift. Ah, interesting. Okay, well, we'll have to do that in a minute. I'm assuming Natalie is hanging around somewhere. Yeah, love, he's over here. Apparently, he doesn't know how to walk slightly round the, the corner. Come on, mate. Escorting survivors, survivors are playing differently depending on the circumstances and their own varying personalities. It's a good idea to escort as many as possible to safety. The security room set goal marker. Okay. Control is call survivor and Q and control is to set goal marker. She's, she seems to be struggling a little bit. Yo. Hey, Jeff. I found Natalie. Oh, look at that. Isn't that nice? Yeah, come on. Let's go. Let's get up here. Follow me. Can you get up? Oh, they can. Nice. Let's go. Just crawl through the ducts. Yeah, nice. Yeah, I don't blame you, love. It's It's not gone great. That's cool then. So straight away we've managed to uh Ooh, leveled up. Yeah. 
Prestige points reward for actions such as scoring survives to save your defeating zombies when the PV gauge becomes full, Frank levels up. Attack power increases. Uh, items like get thrown. A new skill is learned. I see. And what skill have I just learned? Is that a weapon? The soccer balls count as a weapon? That's... Okay, fair enough. I'll, uh, I'll reserve judgment until we actually, you know, kill a zombie. Ah. Yeah, yeah, I can hear you, mate. Okay, let's let's have the rundown. Paradise Plaza. Oh, mind your legs. Oh, nice. Okay, we've got weapons. Different items or different actions. So I have to get a special holding the thing for a moment. All right. Okay. What does this do if I hold it? It looks like it's just that. Ah, nice. Not. Ooh. <gasps> sledgehammer. Give me the sledgehammer. Yes. Yes, give me that shit. I'm gonna fucking sledgehammer someone. Oh! Bloody hell. I really thought that was gonna explode. <laughs> I don't get down from here without breaking my legs. And can I get back up? I'm assuming I can get back up. Maybe there's a ladder. Oh, hang on, I see. Oh, oh, god damn. That was a bit. Yeah, I can. Nice. Ugh. You can hit people with mannequins as well. Awesome. Get off me. Okay, I'm going to have a look at Paradise Plaza because we need to have a look at some combat before I end this video. Because otherwise, well, we don't know what's going on with it. I mean, it's, it runs perfectly smoothly. It's absolutely stable. I'm not seeing anything in the way of dodgy frame rate drops or anything like that. There's been no crashes or anything. The loading is frequent, but it takes no time. Like, no time at all. You've seen as we've been going through, there's just no... Christ. Or I'll bash your head in. Uh oh. It's probably just a sprain. I've got to help Brad, or he's done for. All right, fine. Give me your gun. Come on. Uh. <laughs> got hurt. Let me help. No. She's not gonna give him the gun. A civilian do that. That's against regulations. Yeah, see. Yeah, well, Never give away your gun. They had zombie-infested malls in mind when they wrote those regulations, kid. You know how to use this? He's like, you call me a kid. Kinda. I've covered wars, you know. You point the end with the hole in it at someone's face, and then you press, and then you pull the little lever on the front. Look, I you, see. You put the safety on. You and I are gonna have a nice little chat. <laughs> She's like, all right. I suppose I can't. Okay, case one one. Oh, cool, this is getting more complicated now. Okay. Oh. Cases. Case panels form a guide to solve the mystery behind the incident when you encounter a key event. A new case panel opens, saying you are so close to the truth. Oh, that's cool. Okay, that's that's pretty cool. Back up for Brad. All right, then. Oh, straight in, eh? Okay. So we need to go that way. All right. Excuse me, boys. Oh, you cheeky bitch. I'm going to have to stop. Oi. Get out of it. No. No. Fuck your gun. I don't need a gun. Have you seen this sledgehammer? Go that way. Uh, can we... Awesome, excellent. That's what I was hoping we could do. I could hit someone with a potted plant. That's funny. This. Who needs a gun? What's the point? 
<laughs> What's the point? Have you seen this sledgehammer? Oh, a bit, bit, bit of a swift one, were we? Oh, God, it's so meaty. Oh, cheeky. Just stay down, boy. No. Okay. I can absolutely rescue Brad here. No problem. No problem. Let's get our feet wet. Oh, is he outside? Is he doing outside the madman? The absolute madman. Okay. Oh. So, uh... He is. He's over here. Is he trying to run off? The cheeky bitch. The cheeky motherfucker. He's probably just in the other part of the park, ain't he? Park the mall. Probably could have gone in um, by walking all the way round, but instead I took like a shortcut. I want to take a photo of one of these bastards. Hey, bitch. Say cheese. Okay, time to uh, time to get out of the camera now. Just in case. Oh man, there's loads of the fuckers over there. That's got to be a good photo, right? Oh, nice. Not bad. Have you seen how many zombies there were there? You taking the piss? <laughs> I'm just like wandering about. <laughs> okay, getting in those doors could, might be tricky, but it'll be fine. Right, bitch. You should have put some trousers on. What even is that look? The I'm I'm. Oh dear! Oh dearie me! What is that? Yes. 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 Let me use that lawnmower right the fuck now. Give me it. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, guide arrow cursor. Oh, yes. This is how you get through here. Oh. It's harsh, but necessary. I need to get in this door, boys. And you're in my way. I've got no choice. I've got to clear the area. I hope you know that I I hold no ill will towards you uh, as the humans that you used to be, but as zombies, you just you've got to be dealt with. Okay, you've just got to be dealt with. I, I, there's really no alternative for me here. <laughs> it is so dumb. It's so dumb. See, this is the thing that I liked about Dead Rising Three: the ridiculous method in which you kill zombies but the problem with Dead Rising 3 was that it was like he complained about it whilst he did it so far Frank West has been all business which is what I like he's not bitching or complaining or pretending to be absolutely horrified by everything he sees he's just like well this is fucked up and that's like his entire thing about it which is what I really pissed me off with Dead Rising 3. It's like you, you can't have me going around in uh, women's underwear beating people to death and then complaining about the fact that they're zombies. Mate. What are you, what are you shooting at me for? What's his problem? Yeah, she sprained her ankle. You know how to use that gun. Just tell what the fuck is this guy doing? Do it. All right, I'll cover you from here. You need to stick to the shadows. Try to get close to the target, okay? And what am I supposed to do when I get close? Shoot me in the head. Well, the best solution would be to shoot the guy. But if you can't do that. 
Keep him busy dodging your bullets and stay out of trouble. Are you up to it? I'm a lot better with a camera. But yeah, I'll give it a shot. See, see, yeah, I'll give All it a right. shot. <laughs> Next time he reloads, I'll lay down a suppressing fire. Okay, cheers, mate. I'm counting on you. Make well. <laughs> I don't this guy why is he uh why is he shooting again oh whoa 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 can I can I crouch god damn it uh wait how do I Ah, shit. How do I crouch? It's not C, it's not B, it's not... What the fuck, mate? I'm gonna fucking... I'm gonna quickly check the options here, because uh, that is weird. Okay, interact, use, talk straight left and right. Okay, fine. Aim weapon is Q. Call survivors. Scroll item. Check map. Quick time events. I can't see anything for crouching. Or sprinting. So have I just got to run? Like a nutcase? I guess I'll just be running then. Ooh. Quick, leg it. You should try and get up there, though. I think. Okay, let's, uh... Oh, don't like that. What's he even laughing about? What's his problem? Mate, you were nice to me earlier. What the fuck is this? Any chance? I can't get through there. Oop, I can't go that way either. There's got to be a way for me to get up there, right? Chuck a knife at him. Come on, stick your head out. Stick your head out again. Uh, don't want anything to do with that. Come on, let me shoot you. Let me just once. Just a tickle. Just a tickle. Oh, I can get up there. I see. Sorry, Brad. I was feeling slow, but it's all right. Oh, oh, oh. God, shit. Okay, well, I know what I'm doing now. That's irritating. I don't like the fact there's no crouch. That's weird. That's odd. God knows where that's going to put me back. Hopefully just at the start of this. Yeah, it will do. Oh, shit. Really? Wow. No auto save on this, then. Bloody hell. I didn't even think to save it. That was the first, what, 35 minutes or so of Dead Rising. Seems to be a pretty decent uh, a pretty decent port, a pretty decent update. Load times are exceptionally quick. It doesn't look too bad, it does look dated. And uh, just remember to save all the goddamn time. Because if you don't, there's no autosave by the look of it. And you will lose all of your progress. As I've just done there. Thank you very much for watching. <laughs> I'll see you next time. <laughs> Whoops.